How's it going, mates? This is this is Charles. We're back, Sun Hill One for the PS One Retro Arc on a laptop, double sided. I oh, don't know. <laughs> it's just Sun Hill. It's the first one. You know it. You love it. It won a few awards. Good for Silent Hill. All right. Previously, I found this house on the edge of nowhere. I also found a key that goes with the house, but I don't know what to do with the key. I don't know if it's meant to be part of those other key holes that I meant to unlock in that other, you know, the dog house house. Um, but yeah, now I'm not really sure what to do. Do I unlock the first part of the house? I don't know what else I can do. And I'm also not sure why there's a little arrow saying, hey, go across the bridge. Because I don't really understand why is that bit available, but the school isn't. I mean, I, I suppose maybe, like, because Cheryl's where... The shows like the school shows where the school is. What strange use of grammar! But yeah, I don't know. I don't know where this game's leading me now. I had a hint, a little sniff of a chance of beating the game, of knowing what I was doing, and now I don't. I ate it. I digested it. It is now part of my body. Please go away. You could die for that, or you can at least have a bullet to your leg, to your strange dangling spaghetti legs. I also made a spaghetti bolognese recently. I'm looking after my girlfriend because she's ill. She has COVID. I think it's the Omicron. Or Delta. Oh, I can't keep track anymore. <laughs> but yeah. That's been nice. I made my first bolognese. It was to help her through her ailing time. And she really liked it. I didn't. That spaghetti, the actual pasta itself, was saltier than salt. Saltier than pretzels. Saltier than this fucking... Pterodactyl bullshitter's attitude. Right, what's this? Um, well, I could use that. Is that another key? Oh, good. So I am meant to just guess where everything is. Right, that's a slight concern to me because I have no idea where the third key is going to be. But I probably probably have a f two choices it's either one in that alleyway because that's what's been highlighted or two it was in the house somewhere because it is a red dot now or well, maybe that's just for you know locating purposes so i can find my way back okay in, in any case i'm more convinced there's something in that alleyway because that alleyway was drawn on the map but we went through that alleyway and I couldn't see anything. But then I guess I wasn't searching for the key. So maybe it's there. Maybe I should actually use my eyes. What, what are eyes for, eh? Are they for eating? Are they for redecorating curtains with? I don't know how I'd redecorate my curtains, but when there's a will. Right. Where are you? No. God, it really helps that they're, like, properly in the angle of the camera. Or in the camera angle, whatever I was going to say there. Okay, I'm nearly at the alleyway. Yeah, let's zoom in to make sure it's an alleyway still. There must oh, go away! Eat! Eat! Why are there so many of you? God, you guys must breed like rabbits. What do you eat? There's no food here. Or do you eat the dogs? And sometimes the dogs eat you? That doesn't make any sense. Normally, there's like a nice triangle when it comes to... You know, predators and prey. You've got tons of prey. And then the further up you go, the less predators there are. Because, you know, <laughs> there needs to be a decent amount of food for all the animals to thrive on. And I suppose there's less dogs than there are pterodactyls. I haven't actually noticed the dogs that much. Still. Right, yep. Yeah. Is that another? I can hear the flapping wings of a demon. God, this place must have been populated with like a billion humans once. I mean, these guys must be a dying species by now. Please die. All I want to do is concentrate on the game. Fuck you. Okay, this off-limits bit seemed a bit strange to me. Oh, uh, okay. I'm surprised that worked, to be honest. So there must be a key somewhere here. Somewhere around here. Where is the last key? I never watched Carmen San Diego. It's just a meme I know, okay. Oh, there we go. Nice and easy. Oh, good. Cool. Well, now I just have to go back, unlock the door, and hope for the best. 
door uh, chamber of secrets. I don't know what it was, but we're going back. And actually, so far, this game is quite manageable. Like, it's nowhere near as annoying or difficult as Sunhill could be. Or Sunhill Hill 2, sorry. Um, it's quite performance-wise, I prefer this one. But then, you know, I couldn't get the HD version to work for the life of me. The, the one that is praised by all. Alright, anyway. I should really stop ranting about Silent Hill 2. But I just can't help it. I, just, I, I really miss that game, to be honest. It was really great just, you know, watching the intro every morning. Or well, not every morning, but every morning I did Let's Plays. And I'd just sip the coffee and just, you know, enjoy the music. I really enjoy the music of Silent Hill. There's nothing like it. And yet this guy does not have a platinum record to his name. Akira Yamaoka. What is wrong with the world? Don't know. But there you go. I guess people prefer Wiz Khalifa. And I can't even name a Wiz Khalifa song. Why? Because I am a fool. Because I do not listen to Wiz Khalifa. But then again, I, I don't listen to much that's contemporary. Or, you know, meant to be good. I can't even name an Ed Sheeran song. And I know everyone in Exmouth is obsessed with Ed Sheeran. It's like one of the prerequisites for living here. I came in as a carer, so I don't technically own or... Well, I live in the house, but, you know, I, I didn't have to, like, fill in any paperwork. If there was paperwork to live in Exmouth, question one would be, would you like Ed Sheeran? And it would be mandatory to say yes. How the hell do I get back there? Wait a minute. Oh, no, oh, sorry. I, I got confused. I thought I was meant to go from, like, the left side, but actually, Levin Street... I meant to go in from the right side. Never mind, I'm just being an idiot. Right, anyway, yeah, Ed Sheeran's cool. Oh, well, I can't really do his music, but I feel like I'm going to lose several subscribers for saying that. Well, I don't know, I just, I, I don't care for his voice. I don't care for his choice of topic when he sings. Like, I like Van Halen. They sing about an ice cream man. They sing about a hot teacher. They sing about Unchained. They sing about... I have a motorbike in one of the songs. I hear Ed Sheeran sing. I can't even think what he sings about. But then that's probably because I don't use my ears when Ed Sheeran sings. Okay, yep. Yeah, use all of them. Unlock the chamber. I really should have saved the game first. I'm not ready to enter. Please don't. Yep, good for me. That was definitely an achievement noise. So the achievement ping still happens. That's nice. I guess it's a good way of knowing that you know, I, I've done something in the game. Good way of checkpointing once something's happened. Right, finish saving, cool. Alright, and we're half an hour into the game, apparently. I mean, I've been playing for at least an hour, but whatever. I guess I did die, though, so that probably shaved a bit of time off. What? Uh, it's getting dark again. What's going on? Well, you know, day and night is a thing. I mean, I toss and turn and keep stressing my mind, mind. I look for peace, but see, I don't attain. What? What? I don't know the full list of that song either, but then that was a, you know, insane thing in the late 2000s. Alright, that seems nice. Lovely music. Is this one of Beethoven's? Is it a buck? Is it a chopping? Right, that's literally where I was, so I'm pretty sure I'm not going there again. A uh, nice gate out. Am I going to visit the neighbours, have a barbecue? Am I going to get some nice demons that are going to try and stab me again? Am I, like, dreaming? Am I, like, you know, just like, hey, I'm, I'm a bit tired. I'm going to sleep in this guy's house. Oh, my controller fight. Oh, good. Demons again. Well, you know what? I, I wouldn't be scared of that, except, you know, I've dealt with that constantly today. Go away. I don't like you. Give me something that's on the ground. Give me something that doesn't fly and piss me off. I thought they'd be scarier than this, to be honest, but they're not. They're just very annoying. Right, yeah, I hear the radio. I have no idea where I'm going. Oh, okay, we're on the... Right, okay, so I guess I can make my way to the elementary school now? That's my current goal. So I can't see where the hell I'm going. No, I can't see you, but I know you're gonna... Oh, God! I hope you died. I hope that hurt you. I hope that made you sad. Alright, my health isn't looking great, so I better try and uh, look after myself. 
All right, I'm looking. I'm not doing a bit better now. I've got a lot of health drinks only because I actually have conserved them lately. So I should be okay getting to where I need to go. Way down Midwich, though. Okay. Or at least I imagine I need to make my way down Midwich. Where's this then? Uh, I can't read because this. That's McFinney. What road am I on? Where am I? What is this? Okay, no, that must just be Finney Street. So I need to find a corner bit. Is it maybe down this bit? Is it this one? No, that's just leading me more to... So apparently I need to take a left. But there is, though. If I go left, then it leads... Oh, down the road. Okay, cool. Well, I guess I didn't know what left meant. No! Oh, God, no more! God, can you scare me with, like, I don't know, an evil tank or something? Give us some Devil May Cry 2 action. Or like a demon helicopter. Or a spider. Spiders are good ways of scaring people. These spiders aren't annoying. God, next time a spider comes off me, I'm never going to be like... I, I'm going to be grateful that I, I'm, I'm just scared of it. If there's like a giant tarantula that comes out and I shit myself, I'll be like, well, at least it's not flying. I hate flying things. I know birds are nice to look at, but they're... They're very annoying when they're trying, you know, steal your sandwich. Like a seagull. Well, I suppose I'd rather have seagulls as pests than snakes. Oh, God. That sounds like a bigger one. Yep, go away. You can try and play fetch with me all you want. But I don't have a stick. It's not in my inventory. Ha! Huh. See? Look! No oh, I suppose I have a pipe, actually. Well, I'm sorry. This is my pipe. You can't have it. I got it off some alleyway. Alright, so we're nearly at the elementary school. For some reason, I've started zooming in on the map again because I'm an idiot. Right, school. Uh, am I anywhere near the school? All I'm seeing right now is a bunch of bushes. I'll go. Well, this looks like the right way because there's demons trying to eat me. Ah, that was a pleasant walk through the, the avenues. Nice Sunday walk. It's actually Monday for me right now, but, you know, it might be Sunday this thing's being released. Alright, cool. Nice school. Nice place. Am I here for a little parents' evening? I mean, it, it, it seems to be night time, so it might be more parents' night, unless it's the winter. Oh, school map! That'd be helpful. Uh, I just want to find the safe point at this point. I mean, I, I've had a good time. I've had a good run for my money. I'm not dead yet, which is a relief. Thus far, but you know, that's going to change soon, isn't it? Right, what does my map say? Mm, okay, a few teachers' rooms, a few classrooms. Gotta admit, this is quite a small school, but then I suppose, like, you know, there's a little staircase there, there's a few, you know, there's a few stuff here. It all looks a bit tiny, though. But I'm, I'm used to a huge giant assembly hall in Britain. Maybe it's just like trying to be conservative for an elementary school. All right, uh, what's this? Can I, um... More Ronaldo Gordon. This must be the list of teachers. Well, I guess, but they're not going to be in, are they? They're not going to tell me how my Cheryl is doing. Is she doing well in her maths? She better be, else she's not getting a new Xbox for her birthday. Right, ammo. God, man, I'm a bit surprised that there's no save point here. I mean, I could start using save points or some... A picture of a door. I don't know who drew it, but it's certainly in bad taste. I mean, you could say that. I think it's a masterpiece. It's just a shame that something as boring as a door. Or well, maybe it's meant to be a sacred door. Maybe it's a special door. Maybe it's the doorway to some birthday cake. I don't know. Probably find out. Oh, blood red handwriting. This is a good sign. It's written in blood. Oh, God. 10 o'clock alchemy laboratory. Gold in an old man's palm, the future hidden in his fist. Exchange for sage's water. Am I meant to know what that is? Is that some kind of, like, you know, abbreviation in the medieval times I'm supposed to know? Cool. Well, it's a shame I couldn't adjust the riddle difficulty at all. Yeah, uh, it's written in blood again. Darkness that brings the choking heat. Flames rid of the silence, awakening the hungry beast. Open time's door to beckon prey. Good. Could you speak normally? Oh, God, what now? 12 o'clock, a place with songs and sound. A silver guy poses untapped in lost tongues, awakening at the ordained 
order. Right, I'm noticing there's a lot of um, references to alchemy and, you know, uh, elements. So that must come in handy later. There's a little prism on the desk, but I can't seem to pick it up. Or if I can, I'm being an idiot about it. All right, so reception seems like a nice place to work. You know, do they, do they get dental here? They better bloody do. Hmm. I can't seem to find a place to save. And I really want to, because I don't want to run out of time and then find, uh-oh, I'm going to die. I suppose maybe the save point is in the infirmary. This is a bit of a strange place to have a place to record my notes, though. Uh, all right, I can have an eye test there. That's good. A little lie down. That's good. Oh, is that? Ah, uh, oh, yes. Thank God. There's no way I want to go all the way back to the doghouse. Jesus. All right, cool. And I think that's a good place to end the episode. So Silent Hill One. I'm actually really enjoying it. I'm actually enjoying the game mechanics the, and you know the graphics and all that i'm enjoying that more than silent hill 2 to be honest the only thing with silent hill 2 i preferred was the story because it was a nice kind of you know everyone's in this mysterious town they've been led here for some reason or another and james is trying to find his love but what's the plot was at the end and you've got to find out and get to the end and go through some annoying puzzles and deal with some demons some really annoying portrait people but you know what can you do we're silent hill 1 I suppose it's a bit more mysterious what's happening with Cheryl and stuff, but, like, anything could happen. There's predators everywhere. And you know what? I don't even feel that safe. But everything feels much more enhanced, and, you know, the Duck Station is a brilliant... I know it's a retro arc, but I'm using the Duck Station core. It's really great at capturing PS1 games. But if you want to play the game for yourself, I'll leave, like, an Amazon link to a... I don't know, a Silent Hill 1 thing. I know you could illegally go on, I don't know, ROM Island or some shit, or just search it on Google, and then see if you can get a copy of Silent Hill 1 in on Google. But I'll leave a link to the Amazon game in the description down below. And without further ado, the Whipscratch until next time. See ya!